and said Real Zaragoza with the visitors bent on responding to the situation they've gotten themselves into. Carlos Puyol of Barcelona, all business as he leads his mates out. The referee getting the business from the home fans. Thousands of red cards handed out so fans could protest recent calls against their club. But early on, it's the host serving up as their own worst enemy. Delio Toledo with the back pass. That beats Ruben Falcón. The own goal puts Barca up 1-0 in just the second minute of play. Goalkeeper Ruben disgusted. The keeper caught flat-footed in the pass. A little out of reach. Barca spotted a goal right off the top. Nearing the half hour, more from the visitors as they beat the trap and make it look easy from there. Samuel Ito, the pass to Ludovic Giuli, that's a tap in, and Barca is off and running. Fans in Zaragoza, as you might expect, not satisfied that the play was on side, but the goal stands, and it's celebration time. Just minutes later, it's three goals in front for Barcelona. Ronaldinho with a nice ball for Ito, and Samuel simply pops and pokes, taking care of the rest. That is pretty. Still Barcelona by three in the second half when Zaragoza gets on the board. Luciano Galetti making it so. Galetti with a higher low shot. Victor Valdez just can't catch up to it. Galetti surprising Valdez with a quick strike back where he was coming from and that makes it a two goal affair. But Barcelona sticks with it and closes things out in the 71st. Rafael Marquez getting his head on the corner kick. 4-1 Barca wins convincingly. Al Sadar Stadium in Pamplona, the side of this one. David Beckham, Iker Casillas and friends out to hand Osasuna just their second home loss of the season. Bulk of the crowd looking for the opposite. Early on, Javier Aguirre's side threatens from a free kick. Francisco Puñal with the kick to Richard Morales, but Iker tips it off the bar and out of play. The hosts, oh, so close to taking the lead. Later in the half, it's Osasuna again. The deep ball headed on for Pierre Weibo, and the Cameroon striker strikes. 1-0 home team and time to celebrate. You know what? Maybe even time to rock a baby. Yeah, fit it in there. Same score now as we shift to the second half. And Valdo with some creativity to almost push his side up by two goals. Casillas with a nice leaping effort. Soon after, more Osasuna and more Valdo. This time, the 23-year-old beats Casillas, but is beaten by the woodwork. Check it out. Osasuna carrying the play, but only up by a goal on Real Madrid. And that changes here. The visitors with a disputed free kick, and Ricardo Senzo can't hold on to Roberto Carlos's blast. Raul's follows. Michael Owens does too. That's the one that's going to count. It's a 1 1 game. Owen just coming on as a sub and managing to square the match. Vanderlei Luxemburgo singing in the Pamplona rain. Carlos with the trademark drive. Raul the second chance. Owen puts it away on the third opportunity. And minutes later, Real Madrid cashes in again. A Beckham free kick dropped by Senzo. Ivan Elgara is there to stuff it in. 2-1 visitors snatching the lead. Real Madrid has sneaks one. And sneaks one out on the road in the process, keeping pace with Barcelona. To Seville now for Sevilla, home to Villarreal. It's the host with the most in the first part of this one. The cross redirected on goal by Renato, but Jose Manuel Reina is there. And he squeezes it. Sevilla with a nice chance to take the lead. Ten minutes later, similar chance develops, and this time... Well, this time the home team capitalizes. Fernando Salas with the tantalizing cross for Julio Baptista. And Julio puts it where he wants it to go. 1-0 Sevilla in the 36th. Villarreal soon creates down at the other end. Marcos Antonio Senna with a long bomb forcing Esteban to sprawl. He does, though, and keeps his team out in front. That's a great save off a terrific shot. Early in the second period, Sevilla almost doubles their edge. Aitor Osio's free kick nearly finding the top part of the net. A solid effort, but not the insurance they were looking for. A little later, though, their luck changes. A penalty awarded off a collision in the box. Osio drops and off to the spot will go Sevilla. Julio Baptista, the man with the plan for the hosts, and his straightforward plan is going to pay off. His second of the match puts Sevilla up by two. But just three minutes later, a little turnabout for Villarreal as they win a PK from this sequence. This time, Osio, the guilty party, he picks up a second yellow, dropping his team to 10 men in the late stages. That second goal now more important than ever, especially when Juan Raquel May scores on the spot shot, cutting it to a one goal game. But that's as close as they would get. 2-1 Sevilla. With that mark under his eye, a souvenir 